Hey everybody, this is Kuin Pack with Let's Play Onit, and we actually have to listen to these altars real fast. Because the altars are going to tell us hints that we need. Lowliest of all remains the Earth Dweller, ambition stifled by the wheel's light. The wheel's light. Don't mind me. Want to adjust something again. Excellent. As equals two walk beside one another in light, five acknowledge their place. Nice, nice, sir. I can technically turn off the light filter. I guess I should, just because we don't need it anymore. All right, I'll turn off the filter. Give me a second. I might have been a little too early for that, but whatever. Now you can see how dark it is for real. I want to turn off the filter. One. He's looking for knowledge. We got some knowledge. Small creature held out the ancient writing. Now the reason I wanted to turn off the filter is because the end credit cutscene might happen either in this video or the next one. And it's going to look oversaturated as hell with the light feature turned on. So instead of messing the ending up, I'm going to turn off the light feature now. Hey, he's summoning the devil. The devil. Cool. He's opened the chambers. We need him to do this. Thank you, Bergen Kunger. Of course, he cannot fit into the hole. He is too big and Jarnarmus to get in there. Jarnarmus? That's a good way to say it, Ku. And tell me what you see. Burger Kungan commanded the small creature who saw its chance to reunite with its friend. Yay, let's go in. Let's go to the lobby and get some snacks. Oh, God. Are you okay down there? I'll figure out a way to help you out. Don't worry. The small reassured the Alva as it started to explore the new found cave. Awesome! Look at what we got. Stuff! Mushrooms, mushrooms. Oh, the feet! Venomous oh god, why is it gotta be about feet? Were spreading aggressively throughout the cave. Oh man. Venomous mushrooms, you say? The small creature dared not to disturb the hazardous looking mushrooms. Oh, come on. I don't know what that did. Oh, the water makes the mushrooms get all wobbly. Be here. Oh, okay, cool. And air is not an option. Oh, hey, look, Bergen Kunger's tail. A long, hairy tail was sticking out from behind Burger Kungan's massive body. I like this little chamber. I should be wary where I place my feet. The small creature thought as it gently. I should really not pull his tail. He might kick me with his big massive feet. Except we're going to take the tail. Hmm. No. What? Use the bent dagger on the Oh wait, I need to unbend the dagger. Oh look, a vibrant jewel. A precious gemstone rested safely inside a cavity in the wall. Nice, nice. Ooh, a very magical gemstone indeed. It has the power inside of it. Gemstone. All right, let's go get it. Luckily for the creature, the dagger had been bent at an angle to slide perfectly into the cavity. Ooh, now we have a gemstone. Removed it like a true pro. At the same time, causing the dagger to return to its original shape. Awesome. Whoa, whoa, holy shit, what? Excuse me? Eye. A large glowing eye had revealed itself. Yo, this whole place is dangerous. Observing the creature in silence as it moved about the cave. 
Hey, hello. I'm sorry. I hope it wasn't me who woke you up. The small creature said, holding its hands in front of its face, struggling to look at the bright eye. Ah, if I had the light filter on, it'd be extra bright. Stemming from the large eye made it impossible for the creature to touch it. Aw, oh, damn it. Hey, look, a fossil. I need to look at everything, trust me. Inside the cave wall, packed between dirt and rock, rested the remains of an ancient creature. Ooh, talk to the fossil. Hmm, this doesn't look like anything I've met before. The creature muttered to itself as it tried to imagine what the creature had looked like if it had still been alive. Uh, how about the stalagmite? A lone stalagmite was standing in the cave. I wouldn't say it's a lone one. I know you're there. Come out and show yourself. The <laughs> oh, it thinks it's one of those guys from earlier. It didn't seem capable of responding. All right. Well, let's touch it. Feeling the stalagmite's rough surface with its hand, the small creature searched for a beard, yet could not find one. It is a real, a real boy. Uh, give me, give me your tail me. Yay, tail hair! The small creature took the ball of hair sitting at the end of Burger Kungan's tail in one hand and the sharp dagger in the other as it carefully began to cut a few strands at a time until the tuft of hair came off. Well, now you don't got any hair. There's a hole. There's a hole. There's a hole in the bottom of the cave. Hands as it attempted to retrieve it. Oh, come on. I need to get that. Wait. I have a way to take it. Cool! Using the old canvas, the creature was able to pick up the hot gemstone. Wimpack's liking this. We're getting progress. Hmm. No. Air tub. Ring? No, that's not how it happened. Uh, water. Huh. It won't let me... There's holes everywhere. Uh, what happens if I touch the altar? Oh, it's... Oh, it's the puzzle from before. Uh, huh. So... Ba -ba -ba. Uh, but, but, oh, everything surrounds the sun. This needs to be in the middle. Uh, I don't know how any of these shift. Okay. Oh, but no, there's got to be an order to it. Oh, God. Oh, no. It's one of these. Oh, no, but it moves everything. It's got man and woman. <sighs> What's the lowest thing? Okay, no, I've definitely met. I, there's a pattern to it. Um. And this one. Oh no, the sun's at the top, not the middle. And then, there we go, I think. Yes! People, the forest dwellers, shade at the bottom. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Like the elves, and it's like everything we've seen in the adventure so far. What have I done? Out of the darkness, a crackling and glowing stone emerged, lighting up the cave with its overwhelming energy as it levitated calmly above the altar. Awesome. I don't know what they've done that has is in particularly done. As the creature emerged from the hole. It spotted the sling nose troll throwing the pendant on the ground, shattering it. Filthy craftsmen who can't even separate fool's gold from a real thing. If I find them, I shall give them a quick departure from their pathetic existence. Oh god, oh no. <laughs> I didn't know it was fool's gold, man. 
Oh, can I take that now then? He's not looking. The slim nose uh, can I grab this with this? Yes, I can. The Excellent. Bent down and scooped up some of the spit into the cup of Sigrin. Suddenly, the mucus had turned green, and instead oh, flowed a putrid, endless stream of poison liquid. All right. Well, I'm out of time, unfortunately. So this has been Coup Impact with Let's Play Onit. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment next time. Well, hopefully we can get a piece of this orb because we still have three orb pieces we haven't collected. Yet, we also haven't rescued our Alfred yet. So hopefully we can get it done.